This method answers some key questions in the renewable resources utilization field about lignin, a key component of lignocellulosic biomass. The main advantage of this technique is that it allows you to obtain lignin of good structural quality from different biomass sources. This novel methodology specifically targets the beta of 4 linkage. At the same time, it prevents recondensation processes from happening. This is very important as it prevents char formation. Using these methods, relationships can be established between the lignin extraction procedure and the depolymerization efficiency. Generally, individuals new to these methods will struggle with the workup procedures as well as the analysis of different lignins and the depolymerization product mixture. To produce cut walnut shells, equip a hammer cutter with a 5mm sieve at the outlet and feed the walnut shells into the hammer cutter, collecting the fractured shells in a 1 liter glass beaker. To produce the small walnut shell fragments required for milling, feed the fractured shells into a micro hammer cutter equipped with a 2mm sieve at the outlet, collecting the ground shells in a new 1 liter glass beaker. To remove extractives from the ground walnut shells, add 150 grams of the shell sample into a 500 milliliter round bottom flask containing a stir bar, and add 200 milliliters of toluene to the flask. Attach a reflux condenser to the flask, and heat the mixture to a reflux temperature of 111 degrees Celsius in an oil bath with vigorous stirring. After two hours, remove the flask from the bath to allow the mixture to cool down to room temperature and strain the mixture through a 180...